Hey there, Rock and Roll Junkies. Let's do another unboxing, because it's apparently all I do now is unboxing for... Funny enough, just for... I mean, exclusively a King Diamond Merciful Fate unboxing channel now. Because here, what we have is... What was the last one of Merciful Fate unboxing? So this is going to be a King Diamond unboxing. The last time we got this, and this time... Um, let's see what I got this time. Yeah, I'm, just, I'm just so lazy, but these are the easiest types of videos to make. So, yeah, I exclusively have only done unboxing videos. Just literally, all you do is just open a box. There's no work to it. But, as you can see by the hat, I saw my dude's DRI. And, um,. I just, there's a bunch of just, I want to do a whole recap video of just shows I went to this past year, 2018. And I'll just go back to the reviews because these unboxing things are getting ridiculous. I mean, what's next? Uh, King Diamond socks unboxing. I can't open this, this box, man. It's, it's the hardest thing, I swear to God. But yeah, I want this to become this King Diamond channel. Unboxing King Diamond underwear. Merciful underwear. That's just the point we're getting to. It's like, it's like all right. So here's this box. I'm opening it up. It is open. All right. So at this point, let me tell you. Um, I ordered this months ago. I didn't think it'd actually be here in time the website said we would be shipping it by the end of the, the 2018 beginning of 2019 so i did not expect to get this i actually ordered something else on ebay and when um where i live when i get a package it says um, you have a package so i assumed it was what i got off ebay then i go and i pick up this and it's the king diamond thing and i was just like shocked because um i didn't think it come out this soon this is really cool because they only they are only making 1,984 of these. 1984, like uh, don't break the oath. And I just had to have this. And this cost me $250, then with the shipping, maybe $270. And people always ask me, why, why are you always broke? Because I'm spending my money on statues of King Diamond, he wouldn't. So, all right, box gone. This, unwrap it. Taped. Fantastic. Okay, good. And I'm gonna check later to see if this still is for sale. Hopefully, I'll put the link and then you can see if you can get one yourself. They have other things on the website. I've never actually seen this in person. I've only seen the picture on the website, which at this point, this is what the picture looks like. And this is what this is gonna look like when I open it. Okay, okay. And it's upside down. Oh, they're merciful things. What? Yeah, this is what the picture looks like on the website. Which is, it's a picture, it's not real life. We zoom it in. Flip that over. Got a bunch of text. Um. Ah, it's like the holy story of merciful fate. The band has been on hiatus, someday Marisol Fate might come back for you again, says King Diamond. I'd love that, I'd love him to come back, or well, the whole band to come back and just um, do the tour just playing and don't break the off from beginning to end, that would be like, because I've never seen him solo either. But anyways, this is the box, which I'm keeping this box, because this is such a nice box, and alright, alright, it's here. Make sure the angle is kept. Uh, come on. This is the uh, box that's coming up. Right, there's nothing left in the box, so I'll just put this down here to the side. And more tape. Great. I lost the scissor. i put it here. Um, it's getting dark outside, so I'm losing sunlight. I need light. Lighting. 
do this in the day. So, I got coffee. So, I got to take out the king. The king's ready to rise. Oh, wait a second. Comes in two pieces. So, this is the king. I can tell because I can see through it. This is the stand he's on. Let me take this out. Oh, my dude. Look at this. Oh, my God. Merciful fate, as you can see. And it has the little skulls here. Which look just so cool. The details. This is all, uh, from what I understand, handmade. Which makes it that much more impressive. You can see that. Hopefully, it's a bit blurry. But what it says, it's uh, King Diamond number 0364 of 1984 made. Which is, it's pretty, I, I, I mean, oh my god, I almost dropped it. I ordered this, I think, the day it came out, so I'm not surprised I got one of the first 364 of these, because I just, it's, the second I saw it, I just had to have it. I don't care if it was 200 $300, 500 I would have paid 500 for this. I think it was $23 for that. Oh, it's coming out. Oh my god, look at this. Look at this. He's here. In the flesh. My new King Diamond. And it's so cool. It's got like this little mic. His mic is actually wired. The wire comes out. This is so cool. Just look at the detail on his face. Oh my god. The bone mic. Just the creases in the cape. And the shoes. A little twirl for you. That's dirty on the back. But you know, his hair. Everything. Let's compare it to um, this last King Diamond. Again, King Diamond channel. Like, it, I mean, this, 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 as cool as this is, like, it doesn't look exactly like his face. This one does. They like, look, it looks like identical. Even the eye color looks closer in this one, in the statue, than in the drawing. This I told you I'm not going to open until I get another one. But this I'm going to have, of course, up here. Let me put this back. Let me put him on his stand now. So here's the stand. It's got this here, so I guess he, this goes here. Oh, oh there it is. And then the mic stand. I guess I'll just coil the, the mic around. I think it's so cool you can do this with the mic. Oh, the mic actually has wires to it. And there it is. There is my dude, the king. On his stand with his mic. 270 basically with shipping and everything. And to me, to me, worth every goddamn cent. Nuns have no fun, but I do. It's just so cool, man. It's just, I can't believe. I mean, you can tell it was handmade. It's just such detail and everything. It's like, I'm just, this is gonna be my, my new prized possession. It will be this. And I'll have to care for this till the day I die. I just love it. I love it and, final words, 10 out of 10. If this is still on sale, I highly recommend you buy this. There's another statue. There's one based on his current um, costume and makeup look. And there is like a 3D vinyl of the cover of um, Don't Break the Oath, which I saw it and I, I just, there's, I just seemed too expensive for me to get all the things, the Don't Break the Oath, this, and the Modern King Diamond. So I just got this. And then I saw all the Don't Break the Oath, a picture of it, somebody else who posted it. And I, I just think it's too big in, for me to, to have. But the other statue, King Diamond, looks really cool. On this website, Knuckle Bones, they have a bunch of different statues. They have all four members of Kiss, which I'd love to get at least Gene. A statue like this of him. There's Guns N' Roses, there's one of Ozzy. But for the most part, um, just from this alone, I highly recommend this, this website. I just love them.
and I just, I can't stop looking at it. I, just, I love this man. It's like I can't believe I got it by the end of the year. And that's that's all. I love King Diamond, and I hope you enjoyed this. Um, I'm now a Merciful Fate unboxing channel, so hopefully in the future I can go back to doing actual other things. Like, I, I want to talk about my show at DRI, I have footage of it, I even got the set list from the show, and I, I had just great stories about all these shows I've been to, and I just, I've been so lazy, but I'll get down to it, I'll do it. But yeah, I love this thing, and thanks for watching, remember to stay metal, stay devil, and stay evil, like the king. Alright, zoom in as much as possible, glorious hell, but...